Today's grommet actually hails from the UK, but it's really well known in New England. It's called the Gluggle Jug, and it's got a secret. The codfish decanter was originally known as the Glug Glug Jug. Some people still refer to it as the Glug Glug Jug. I collect pottery. <laughs> and I had to check And you had to, she had to check. It hails from a really well-known area in the UK. Stoke-on-Trent is known for its fine pottery, fine ceramics, and the secret there is all in the clay. They're dishwasher safe, 40 fluid ounces of liquid in the container, and they're really durable, very thick ceramic, and they're also glazed on the inside, which is really important. When these jugs were hanging out in our office, people were coming in and either saying, what is that? It's a cool design, or they came in and they basically had a confession, how it was used, how they received it, how they gave it to people, and so we said, this is a grommet. So Gluggle Jug comes in a great spectrum of colors. Sort of the traditional colors of navy blue and green that you're drawn to, a white, which is classic, that would look great on any table. And then just sort of this newer color wave, like a light blue, almost a Tiffany pastel, blue, yeah. a pastel blue. And then this terracotta, which is one of my favorites. I'm really drawn to these kind of earthy tones. Anything can go in here because they're fully glazed. There's no harsh chemicals that'll leach onto any of the products you put in there. But I wouldn't do like hot tea or hot coffee, boiling, boiling hot. That, that, yeah. that just Nor would I put them in the microwave. You can find the Gluggle Jug in Buckingham Palace. Prince Charles has been known to use these. And you can find them as a centerpiece at Thanksgiving. You could actually put flowers in them. They could rest right next to your stove and you could have your utensils in there. These have a multitude of uses, but the best part is the Glug Glug. The face is bulbing. It's a great mix of something that can be very serious. You could have it at a great dinner party. And it's also full of whimsy. I'm thinking sangria. <laughs> <laughs>